Welcome back to Sarah Sports Rundown. I want to congratulate the football team for an amazing season this year. Everyone here on the Clay community is super proud of you for making it to semifinals. Congratulations. I'm also super excited to announce that the CCHS wrestling season is coming up. So make sure you stay tuned to Sarah Sports Rundown for more details on matches. Now we're about to interview one of the varsity basketball players on how they think their season is going and what they have to improve. Now I'm here with Dayon Bryant, a junior here, and our four man. So how do you think the season is going so far? It's going pretty good so far. We just got to fix up a few mistakes that we're making. And we'll be straight. What do you think you have to improve and what can you work on? Yeah, we got to get into offense faster and, you know, we got to run offense more. And we just got to put the ball in the hole and all comes down to defense. Got to stay locked in and we'll be good. All right, thank you so much. This has been it for Sarah Sports Run. So we caught up with our mascot, Charlie, about how the football season has been for him. Here's what we got. Why did you want to become a mascot for our school? What gave you the inspiration? I wanted to become a mascot to give people some, something they could remember while coming to the games. So this is your first year as being a mascot. How has the season been for you? The season was interesting meeting new people, doing new things. What do you enjoy the most about being the mascot for our school? I enjoy performing in front of the crowds and just keeping the people happy and giving the football team hope to keep going. Have you ever felt uncomfortable in the mascot uniform? Uh, yes, yeah, just a little hot in the beginning of the season while it was warm, but when it got cold or cool, I kept it cold. The last game of the season was against Pinson. How do you feel about that? Is it bittersweet for you? It was bittersweet because I did something I never did before. I got in the uh, middle of the field. Uh, I know it's the end of the football season. Are you going to be involved with anything else after this? Probably just choir and play. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one horse open. The hat. On this occasion, his hat. The hat. The hat. My hat and scarf. This hat. The hat. Magic in his hat. Dasher, Dancer, Prancer, Vixen, Comet, Cupid, Donner, Blitzen, Rudolph. Rudolph, Prancer, Dancer, Dasher, Dancer, Rudolph, Dixon, Prancer, Prancer, Blitzen, Cupid, Rudolph. Oh. Rudolph, Blitzer, Dancer, Prancer, uh, Donner, Dixon, Dixon Rudolph, <laughs> Blitzen, um, Comet, Cupid, Donner, Dasher, Dasher, Dancer, Prancer, Vixen, Comet, Cupid, Donner, Blitzen, Rudolph. Making our spirits bright. What fun it is to ride and sing a slant song tonight. Cookies and milk. Or seven. Cookies and milk. Cookies. Milk. Cookies and milk. Cookies and milk. Cookies and milk. Cookies and milk. Um, but it's better if you do little Debbie Christmas tree cakes.
Mary, did you know? Santa Claus home with him. This Christmas. Rocking around the Christmas tree. Like the halls. Christmas. Christmas. Welcome Christmas. Are y'all the hot chocolate song from Polar Express? <laughs> Jingle bells. Jingle bells. A solid night. Dashing through the snow. We're all through those reindeer. The North Pole. In the North Pole. In the North Pole. 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 North Jesus birthday? Because it's a tradition. It is best to give them to receive. Because giving is the best thing you can do. This week we had an opportunity to catch up with our choir director and a student about the upcoming All-State competition. This is my second year teaching at Clay Chapel High School, and I'm also a graduate of Clay Chapel High School. I graduated in 2011. Um, all my students have different personalities and different talents, and I think they all bring something to our core program, which makes it even better. Um, just the different day that happens every day. Every day is a different day. Every day um, we make new music. Every day we overcome challenges. It's it's a great learning experience for me as a teacher and for my students. So we learn something new every day and we create beautiful music every day. Um, this is a great opportunity for our students to come and sing with other um, great singers from around our state. Um, it's a culmination of probably 2,000 students from middle school to high school who have went through a rigorous audition to get to this point. And it's a, one of the highest honors for a choral student in the state of Alabama. So I think it'll be a great learning experience. They get to work with top-notch um, collegiate core directors. And I think they'll learn a lot. I'm very excited for it. I've been in chamber choir for two years. Uh, I'm excited to go on the Disney trip. I'm excited to do UAB honor choir. And I'm just excited to do new, new, do new music. Uh, I have to take everyone they gave me. <laughs> I have to take all of them, like, seven, I think? Yeah. Wow. Here's another tasty holiday recipe that you can make for your family for the holidays. Today we will be making reindeer chocolate cupcakes. Once again, this is CCN TV's rendition of Tasty. tasty.
Oh my gosh. Are you tired of seeing no internet connection pop up on your computer screen? Well, we have a solution. Get an ethernet cable. Ethernet cables help reduce viruses, also improves better Wi-Fi connection. We can make any link you need. Teachers, if you want a cable, come by Miss Rowland Classroom, room 123 to get yours now. I got an idea. Yes. Get your ethernet cable today. Thanks for tuning in for our sixth episode of Keeping Up with Clay Chockful. From all of us here at Clay Chockful News, have happy holidays and a Merry Christmas! Christmas!